What's good, everybody? It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject here, back with some more NCAA 14 NCAA Simulation Series. This episode, man, we got number one Alabama taking on number 16 Mississippi State. You guys requested the hell out of this game. I personally do not think it's going to be a good game, but most games this year with Bama have not been good games. You know what I mean? So, Battle of Highway 82, SEC matchup. Um, Mississippi State is playing a lot better than I think a lot of people thought they would play this year. Alabama is playing, you know, as good as we all thought they would play this year. So, you know what I mean? It should be a good battle. All right, man. So, this is one of your first times ever watching one of the simulation videos. How we do it. Heisman difficulty. Four minute quarter length. We play as both teams' offenses. Only way we play is the another team's defense is say if Bama goes up two scores. We try to score with Mississippi State. You know, you know what I mean? Make a stop and score again to get back in the ball game. But if we're unable to do that, we'll switch back to Bama and put the nail in the coffin, man. So I don't want any team, I don't want any one team to win more than the other. You know what I mean? A lot of you Bama fans on the Bama LSU game was jumping down my neck. I mean, was jumping down my throat saying, uh, you know, uh, Bama is not playing that well. I was cheating for LSU and blah, blah, blah. I'm coming out here trying to play the most entertaining game as possible, make the game as close as possible. I'm not coming on here trying to make it a blowout because what's the point? We don't want any of these games to be blowouts. We want them to be all be close and entertaining and fun. So, you know what I mean? Without further ado, let's get into it. Shoot the dice on the half. I lost it, then made it back. Bet it up, double that. Head crack, head crack. Get the cash, get the ass. Steve Nash with the pass. Got the drive, no crash. Only do beef with the mash. Plies voice, you big mad. I be dolo, but the game's with me. Never stopping if the tank was empty. Till we touring out in every city. Me and Grease on every titty. Yeah. I love you, girl, if you fucking with me. Loyalty, that means something to me. Never cash no. All right, man, here we are down here in Bama. Bryant Denny Stadium. Trying to come out here and get her done, baby. So let's get to it. All right, man. So Mississippi State wins the toss. Elects to defer. Kicking the ball off to Bama first. This electrifying offense gets to come out here and set the tone. 2 1 company. See if we can get a good return from Jacobs here. He gets lit up out of bounds. 24 yard return. Let's get it. All right, man. Here we go. I try to play better with Tua this time. You know what I mean? It's my first time playing with Bama last week. So, you know what I mean? Y'all can get over yourselves. See what we can do. We got a receiver over the middle off, off rip is Rugs. You know what I mean? Two, all right, here we go. Second and three. Seven yard pickup on that first play of the game. Tua back to pass again. Having to roll out. He's going to take a chance deep and he overthrows everyone. All right, third down here for Bama. You know what I mean? Seeing what they draw up. Hitting the ball off to Damian Harris, and he is brought down for a loss of two. Bama's forced to punt. I mean, so Mississippi State's defense coming out, making a stop here early. They got the ball now. See if they can get a receiver open. Fitzgerald has to scramble out the pocket. He has to get rid of it. We all know this Bama, all, this Bama defense has impressed us big time. I think this Bama uh, defense oppressed everybody a lot last week, shutting out LSU. You know what I mean? So... They're looking to do more of the same here against Mississippi State as Aries, Aries Williams picks up seven there. Third and three for Mississippi State. Same situation Bama faced. This Bama def I mean, uh, crowd is loud. Nice little read option there for Fitzgerald. He gets the block he needs. He picks up the first down and more. He's going down the bounds, and he's going to not take a lick, picking up 10. All right, man, so Mississippi State actually able to pick up their third down conversion. You know what I'm saying? Looking for a receiver over the middle. He hits Gidry. He picks up four. I know I said I don't think this game is going to be that close in real life, but I would love to see Mississippi State, you know, upset Bama as Fitzgerald changes the play there. They were all over that run play, he felt like. Oh, he gets a receiver fresh off the line. It's Mitchell. He's going down the sideline. Can he beat number seven? He gets brought down inside the 10. Osiris Mitchell with a 48-yard 40, reception. All right, man. First and goal here for Mississippi State. Let's get it. Ah, uh, Fitzgerald looking for somebody to get open. He has no one. He's going to use his legs. And he just goes out at the one-yard line, it looks like. Okay. Picks up nine. All right, man. So second to go here for Mississippi State. Their offense is really looking good. Coach is calling Fitzgerald's number. It's a quarterback draw. He gets into the end zone untouched. Mississippi State takes the lead. All right, Bama back here returning another kick. Trying to get things going on offense here, man. Jacobs has amazing blocks, but he's tripped up. 28-yard return. All right, man. First and 10 here for Tua in Alabama. See what they can do here. If they get a receiver open. Ah, uh, two was taking a shot. He does have one. It is J Judy. He's off to the races and he's going to get into the end zone just like that. Jerry, Judy, and Bama are on the board with six. All right, man. So Fitzgerald ran this offense to perfection last drive. See if he can keep it up here. A little play action. He goes over to his receiver. Great route there by Mitchell. Mitchell continues to eat all, uh, Alabama's food here early on in this game. 
All right, here we go. Second and 10 for Fitzgerald and Mississippi State. Hands it off to Williams. Ah, I right, mean, so Mississippi State continues to move the ball. Eight seconds left here in the first quarter. See what Fitzgerald can do. Ah, pressure gets to him. Uses his legs to get out of dodge. He's going to take on his defender head up. He's brought down, and that's going to do it for the first. All right, third and two here. Mississippi State needs this first down. Little triple option. Nick Fitzgerald is able to pick it up himself. Mississippi State is keeping Bama off balance, especially with these play actions. Fitzgerald just goes and hits his uh, running back out of the backfield. Kylan Hill falls down, picks up eight. I think the um, I think the Operation Sports guys might need to, you know, update Bama's defense a little bit because they're a lot better, like I said, than a lot of people thought they were. Ah, uh, Fitzgerald going to the back of the end zone, throws a pick. Getting a little bit too hype there, trying to make a play, and it cost him. All right, man, so Mississippi State misses out on their opportunity to come away with points. Fitzgerald is getting a little bit too eager there to score six. Tua coming right back to Damian Harris here on the screen play. They get a lot of big chunks of yards. A lot of big – I can't talk to it. It's, it's almost 11 o'clock at night, so my brain is kind of going somewhat. All right, man, Tua and company out here. Ruggs is being, is being uh, pressed. No safety help over the top. All right, they have a little bit. Tua has his tight end. Don't know how to say his last name, so we're just going to call him H. You know what I mean? He takes the defender for a little bit of a ride. Bama's down inside the red zone. After starting off slow in their first drive, man, Bama's really gotten it together here. Threatening the score here in the second quarter. Tua going to his receiver. Ruggs, who puts the spin on the defender, breaks the tackle, but Mississippi State is able to stop the touchdown. All right, man, so we got ourselves a third and goal here for Bama. You know what I mean? They want to come away with a point, so they don't want to play too aggressively. They go with the screen, and Harris is actually able to get out in the open. He dives into the end zone, and Ben was able to put six more on the board. All right, man, Mississippi State has a minute 14 to try to get down here and put some points on the board. You know what I mean? They squandered away points by throwing a pick there at the end of the quarter. I mean, uh, the end of the last drive. And Fitzgerald takes a boneheaded sack, losing 13. His Bama defense is stepping it up here a little bit, man. Nick Fitzgerald needs to step it up himself. Oh, a lot of pressure, and Gidry is unable to make a catch there. Clock stops. Third and 23 for Mississippi State. Third and 23. These fans here in Alabama are loud. Controller is vibrating crazy. Well, let's see what Mississippi State can do here. Bama bringing a lot of pressure. Beautifully ran route by Mitchell. He runs a hitch route to the first down marker. He picks up the first down, 28-yard reception. Mississippi State gets the chains moved. Fitzgerald going right back to Mitchell. He continues to eat, eat Bama's food. On the ball, Mississippi State running a no huddle. They don't want to waste a timeout just yet. Another third and nine here for Mississippi State. Bama's really been hold, just holding them back. Fitzgerald changing the play here, going with the screen. Bama's not really full. Got to see what Williams can do. He puts it on the ground. Luckily, Mississippi State is able to recover it. 10 10 here for Mississippi State. They're in no man's land, so they feel like they have nothing to lose here. Trying to pick up the first and pick up, and you know what I mean, put some points on the board. Fitzgerald has a receiver. It's Couch. He comes down with the catch, and it's the first down. Mississippi State uses their final timeout, and they are going to attempt the field goal. 47 yarder from Mississippi State's kicker here. There's some win, you know what I mean, kicking against the win here, but we're going to see if he can get the job done. The kick is up, and it is slightly good. Mississippi State gets on the board before halftime, and that's going to do it for the first half. Bama has the 14-10 lead. Let's see who's going to come out on top at the end of this game here. We got ourselves a good one. All right, man, so here we are to start the second half. Mississippi State starting off with the Rock. What a kick from Bama. Cole is going to bring it out of the end zone anyway. He gets decent blocking. He gets across the 30. He tries to juke inside, but he steps out of bounds. 42-yard return there. All right, so we got ourselves a first and 10. Fitzgerald changing the play there. Feels like the read option was not there. Going to run a play action, which has been hurting Bama all day. He gets a little bit of blocks that he needs. He gets out of the pocket to use his legs, and he's going to go ahead and make that happen. Stepping out of bounds, 16-yard pickup there for Fitzgerald. All right, here we go. Another third and long for Mississippi State. They've been excellent at these all day. Fitzgerald doesn't have a receiver open this time around. Trying to use his legs. Has to end up throwing the ball away, and Bama forces a punt. All three of our uh, simulation games today have been def be been defensive-oriented. You know what I mean? I'm loving it. Not not the normal shootout since we hit rugs again. He jukes inside, gets knocked out of bounds, 18-yard reception. All right, man, here we go. First and 10. Bama's moving. 
The Mississippi State, what can Mississippi State do? Looks like they're trying to bring the house. They do bring the blitz. Two hits his receiver, Smith. He tries to make a move on his defender. 13-yard reception. Bama keeping the chains moving. All right, second and three. Bama getting across the 50. Tua having to get out of the pocket a little bit. Taking a shot downfield. Oh, underthrown as he got hit and is picked off by Mississippi State. Only to a second pick of the year. Neither team is neither team is shutting the door. They just continue to let the, the other team in. Fitzgerald with a play action there. Going to his man, Gidry. I think that's like his second catch of the game. All right, first and 10 for Mississippi State. Another play action. It's been eating Bama alive today. Nobody's getting open for Fitzgerald, though. He's going to have to use his legs. He puts the ball on the ground, and Bama picks it up. Back-to-back -back turnovers. Mississippi State's giving it right back. All right, man. Second and nine here for Bama. Under a minute left here in the third quarter. To a back to pass. He's got Judy. He's open. He hits his man. He try. He back jukes the defender. He gives himself some space. He's inside the red zone, inside the 15 yard line. 37 yard pickup for Judy. All right, man. Y'all know what time it is. Get them fours up. We got ourselves a great game here. 14 10 lead for Bama. Bama is looking to score again. Can Mississippi State hold them to three? All right, so we got ourselves a third and seven here for Bama. You know what I'm saying? Don't want to force the ball in anywhere because you can get three and go up a full touchdown. To a back to pass. Doesn't look like anybody's going to get open. He's, having to, he's flushed out the pocket and he had, just has to get rid of it. Bama has to settle for three. All right, Bama settling for three. The kick is up and it is good. Bama goes up a full seven points here. All right, man, so here we go. Fresh off a turnover for Nick Fitzgerald in his Mississippi State offense. 343 left here in this ballgame. Still a lot of time. Nice little read to Williams there. He picks up a good chunk of yards, falling four for eight. All right, here we go, second and two for Fitzgerald. He's got a man open. It is Williams. He's up the sidelines for 18 yards. First and 10, Fitzgerald and his offenses are moving the ball very, very well, as they have been all game. Bama's very aggressive there. They call it a screen play. They don't get the blocks they need. That play was this close to being a touchdown. Mississippi State runs the screen and only picks up three. You know I mean? They get positive yardage out of it, though. Going back here to the play action, they've been killing Bama with that all day. Fitzgerald takes a very bad sack. Losing 12, 30 and 19 coming up for Mississippi State. All right, so we got 220 left here. You know what I'm saying? In the fourth quarter, let's see what Fitzgerald can, can pull out of his butt. You know what I mean? Nobody's quite getting open for Fitzgerald. Flushed out the pocket, and he's going to get rid of it. Mississippi State forced a punt here. All right, guys, so we're staying on Mississippi State here. Trying to, trying to stop Bama. Get the rock back and see if we can get a chance to tie up this ball game. They pass. Oh, get there. Nobody's on the tight end. He picks up the first down. 16-yard reception. They get themselves a lot of room. All right, man. So, Bama really working on that clock here, as they should. Hopefully, Mississippi State can get a, a stop here. You know what I mean? So, they can use their first time out and keep the clock moving. I mean, instead of keeping the clock moving, Cole's in the backfield, and he lays out Damian Harris, and Mississippi State is going to use their first time out. All right, second and 14 for Bama here. They go back to the ground, and they make the stop. Damian Harris is stopped after three yards. Third and 11 here. Mississippi State needs a big stop right now. All right, we got ourselves a third and 11 here for Bama. They are going to the air. They're going deep, and he and Ruggs drops the pass. Tua doesn't necessarily put it on the money. He's, Ruggs is forced to lay out, and Mississippi State is really lucky there. Mississippi State is really lucky that Tua slightly overthrew his receiver, which doesn't happen a lot. So Mississippi State has one timeout, a minute 23 left. And you know what I mean? They have Nick Fitzgerald ready to try to lead his team down the field. First mixing this here on the punt return. Can he get a good return? His Bama special teams is just as fast as their defense, but Mixon still picks up 20 yards on the return. They're across the 50. All right, man, so Mississippi State, their offense looked really good early. You know what I mean? And uh, they're just looking to get it together here. Nobody's really been getting open for Fitzgerald, but he can do it with his legs. No quarterback spot. Fitzgerald gets down after picking up the first. Fitzgerald going to his running back, Aris Williams, breaking a couple tackles, picking the first down, juking a man out of his shoes inside the red zone, down inside the 15, 21-yard pickup there for Aris Williams. Mississippi State is looking, looking like they're ready to strike here at any moment. First and 10, Fitzgerald calls it. He has a receiver over the middle. It's Williams. He's just short of the first down. Mississippi State needs to get on the ball. Mississippi State needs to pick up this first down here. That way they can stop the clock without using their timeout. Save their timeout. Fitzgerald, his number is called off the quarterback draw. He's down inside the one. I mean, down inside the two. All right, man, so Mississippi State, 20 seconds left here. 
They have one timeout. Fitzgerald's number is called back-to-back with another quarterback draw, and Mississippi State gets into the end zone an extra point away from possibly sending this one to overtime. Mississippi State wins the coin toss, and they're electing to play defense first. That means, that means it's Bama's turn to come out here and play some offense. All right, first and 10 for Bama in the offense coming out here, looking to get it going. Tua drops back. He goes to Harris right out the backfield. Quick little check down. Second and six here for Bama. Trying to keep trying to keep things going. Trying to keep things moving here, you know. Offense has been looking good for sure. Ah, Tua having to get out in the pocket. Using his legs to get rid of it. All right, he just able to get rid of the ball. That would have been a costly sack. Mississippi State defense really, you know, turning it up here in the second in the, in the, in the second half and overtime. Tua back. He's going to his tight end who's going to be stopped short. Bama coming out here with a very gutsy call, electing to go for it here on fourth down in overtime. He goes to Damian Harris, to it throws a pick, and that is a hell of a big time play for Mississippi State. All right, man. So we're gonna stay, we're gonna stay on defense here with Bama. See if Mississippi State really, really tries to score, or they just try to keep it on the ground and go for three. They hand it off to Aris Williams, and he picks up a big chunk of yards early. I hope y'all don't get mad at me for going for it on fourth, man. Like I said, I'm trying to make this entertaining. I'm trying to come out here and make plays. You know what I'm saying? Sorry, not sorry. As Johnson is wide open there, they pick up another first down. They're keeping it on the ground. Easy work. We could have possibly went to set, went to double overtime here, man. But, you know, it happens. Second and 12. Is that a screen? It is a pass, and they're forced to throw it away. All right, man, here we go. Third and 12. Can Bama get a turnover? Get there, Smith. Oh, I'm killing. Yo, that's crazy. I thought we were going to be able to make a play on the ball. I thought he was in position, but Mississippi State gets a walk-off touchdown here in overtime. That's going to do it, man. The clock hit triple zeros. Mississippi State pulls off the upset here in this rivalry game. Hopefully we can get a game this exciting here, um, you know what I mean, this Saturday, man. But I guess that was just a perfect throw. They didn't let me do anything. All right, man, take a look at the final game stats. Two of 12 for 21, 255, two touchdowns, two picks, 57-yard completion percentage, 71 was his longest of the day. For Mississippi State, Nick Fitzgerald, Nick, for Mississippi State, Nick Fitzgerald, 16 for 25, 239, a touchdown, a pick, 64-yard completion percentage, sacked twice. On the ground for Mississippi State, Nick Fitzgerald, 14 for 48, three touchdowns, Ares Williams, 6 for 24. For Bama, Damian Harris, 9 for 9. And, uh, you know, Devontae Smith, 1 for 1. For Steven for Bama, Henry Ruggs, 3 for 40. Damian Harris, 3 for 37, a touchdown. Hell, Hell Hentges, Hentges, 3 for 57. Jerry Judy, 2 for 108, a touchdown. And then Devontae Smith, 1 for 13. For Mississippi State, Osiris Mitchell, 5 for 129, a touchdown. Eris Williams, 3 for 24. Austin Williams, uh, 2 for 27, 2 for 15, 2 for 16, 1 for 20, and then 1 for 8. Defensively for Mississippi State, Cameron Dantzler led the squad and tackles with 4 all solo along with Jonathan Abrams, followed by Cole Peters and Sweat with 3. Two picks caught, one by Mark McLaurin, one by Jamal Peters. And then for Bama, Savion, and then for Bama, Savion Smith, along with McKinney, Carter Diggs, and Sertain led the squad with tackles with 4 all solo. D. Thompson was next with three. Two sacks were made by Christian Miller and Isaiah Bugs. There was an interception caught by Mac Wilson. All in all, it was a good game. I know y'all gonna kill me in the comment section because y'all mad that Bama lost. But like I said, I try hard to make make teams win. I try to make this game as entertaining as possible, and it's just for fun, man. So don't don't get too serious. Bama, like I said, I think Bama's gonna win. I don't think it's gonna be a close game. But hopefully you guys enjoyed, man. If you did, stop and smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new. It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, RKGames.com. I'm out of here. Peace.